Hey, Tori, Geo here with Broken Arrow SEO, a division of Scene Enhanced Marketing. Hope you're having a great day. Just want to thank you for taking the time to watch this video. Uh, today, we're going to be going over three easy ways to beat your competition online. Those three things are content, backlinking, and citations. So, we're going to jump right into that now. I've got your website pulled up here as you can see one of the first things I noticed Tori is your site is unsecure so um, that makes you very vulnerable to you know various things especially in today's day and age um, so that's that's worth looking into and always a concern when I see that it tells me that the site is potentially not being hosted or managed properly so I uh, just wanted to mention that to you initially now uh, I've got your site pulled up here uh, the home page is very important and you know as you can see there's some nice visuals here but outside of that not a lot going on we recommend Tori believe it or not 1500 to 2000 words minimum on just the home page alone of the websites we develop reason being Google crawls these websites and they're looking for buyer intent keyword phrases and so an example would be for you guys I know you're in states bro and you actually do rank okay there uh, but for some surrounding areas, uh, you know, there's going to be relevant keyword phrases based on uh, based on area. So, for example, for your site, plumbers, Statesboro, plumbers, Georgia, even you know, you can look to rank for. People are searching these high volume keyword phrases, and that's why we recommend so much content on the homepage alone because Google focuses on that. They hone in on it and they really, really look for those buyer intent keyword phrases so they can start ranking sites accordingly when people are searching for the services. So the next thing I wanted to talk to you about, Tori, is backlinking. A backlink is just another website that provides power and influence to your website. And not all backlinks are created equal. So similar to the buyer intent keyword phrases, we want the backlinks that we go after to have to do with the industry you're in. So we want them to have to do with plumbing. So websites like plumbing supply companies, for example, maybe home improvement companies, you get the idea. You're going to have a much better time gaining that proper power and influence from those type of backlinks than, say, a local Domino's Pizza or a Macy's department store. Now, a third-party tool we use to measure analytics for all websites is called Arifs. I've got it pulled up here, and I have your website domain plugged in here, as you can see. Now, not a lot going on here. Uh, what this tells me is there is actually very minimal traffic uh, going to your website on any given week or month, and that very little business, too, uh, is, is being obtained uh, from people visiting your website. So lots of room for improvement that's okay I just wanted to give you an idea of how you stack up against some of the competition now I skipped over states bro because you guys are ranking uh, in the map pack rankings here the top three we like to call it as well as the organic rankings so I understand you service other areas so I did a, a generic volumed uh, plumbing brooklet GA search and I'm sure you're familiar with some of uh, these competitors near and just outside your area and I just wanted to give you an idea for comparison purposes. Here's Ruderman, and this is actually a back page of theirs. It's not even their main page. As you can see, it's uh, forward slash uh, Brooklet GA. So this is you know a big company, and they just have service pages in all these areas, probably throughout Georgia and beyond. Now, plug their analytics into or their domain into our third-party analytics tool and look at the difference. They have almost 50,000 backlinks, 32K in uh, traffic revenue going on, 6,600 in organic traffic. Uh, crazy, right? So I just wanted you to get an idea of what is possible when you have the proper SEO, backlinking, content, and citation strategies in place. Now. A tool or a strategy we tell our clients to use to meet or beat uh, said competition it's actually quite simple go after the same backlinks so we'll do one together we'll click on their referring domain and remember we want to go after a backlink that's relevant to the plumbing industry right so we'll scroll down the list here we have access to everything and boom plumbing repair service USA we click on this no explanation needed clearly this has to do with plumbing 
Uh, it looks like just some content surrounding uh, various plumbing services. And so how the backlinking works here is Ruderman has inserted their website domain, their URL, somewhere within PlumbingRepairServiceUSA.com's website. And Plumbing Repair Service USA is providing that necessary power and influence back to Ruderman.com's website. And Google's recognizing that just like it recognizes with the content. And over time, it's ranking them accordingly, allowing them to rank near the top for various keyword searches organically and take on that consistent. So next thing I wanted to briefly discuss with you is citations. Now I mentioned for Statesboro GA, you guys are ranking in this top three already, the local Google My Business Map Pack rankings, but we want to expand, right? This is in Brooklyn. Again, some competitors of yours uh, more than likely. Now, as backlinks were uh, directly influential to organic rankings, which commence here, citations or directories are directly influential to the local Google My Business Map Pack rankings, the top three. And a citation tory is merely just a directory where you list your company's information. So business name, address, phone number, etc. And places like Yelp, Facebook, White Pages, Yellow Pages, you get the idea. And we tell our clients, same strategy as the backlinking. Go after the same citations as the competition and then some. Develop that space cushion. Dozens and dozens more of citations so that eventually you're going to merge nicely into this top three. They're not going to realize that it's going to be too late and you're just going to continually be adding on more and more citations, more and more directories, and again, consistently taking on all that new online business. If you're like me, I don't scroll past the top three. If I'm searching for a service online, especially on my phone, why would I go past this top three? I've got my reviews, linkage to website, uh, location, everything's at my fingertips. So it's absolutely vital to strive to get into these top threes, especially. Last thing I wanted to discuss with you, Tori, is uh, the social media side of things. And, you know, I always like to mention this, especially to our plumbing clients, just how vital uh, of an avenue this is. Uh, there's so much opportunity on Facebook. Everyone's on it. Uh, I see you guys do have somewhat of an active page, but just minimal to no engagement from from people online. So that's something that uh, we strive to accelerate. Uh, and again, you know, three to four weekly posts, uh, shooting for that engagement from the community, potential prospects. There's ad campaign opportunities. Um, for people who are looking for various services that you offer. Again, it truly is endless. I just wanted to touch on that uh, and let you know that we can help. Tori, in closing, I just want to thank you for taking the time to watch this video. Uh, this is 100% free information. This video is yours to keep. Uh, if you would like a screenshot of your analytics here, I'd be more than happy to uh, shoot that over to you via email. I have no problem at all with that. However, if you would like our help with this, by all means, please give me a call back, reply to my email. I'd love some feedback on the video either way. Uh, you can check out our website. It's www.brokenarrowseo.com. Phone number is 918-265-1410. If you want it, it's going to take you right to my direct line. Like I said, I'd be more than happy to discuss things further with you. If you have any questions, concerns, uh, I'm here to help. Tori, it's been a pleasure. Uh, I hope you have a great rest of your week, and I look forward.